um, it is, uh, March, sorry, April 13th, I believe, 2017, going to the emergency room again, <laughs> um, I'm having extreme loss of balance, vertigo, memory loss, focus issues, I am trying very hard not to drink, um, I did relapse about a week ago, other than that, um, every time I move, my head seems to bob, and, uh, I have to walk on the ferry, because when I go over that bump, it feels like my brain is crushing itself. <laughs> my mom would say, you're not supposed to turn your engines on yet, people. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, basically, I'm gonna try to go to AA after the MRI today, and, uh, I'm getting real sick of being sick and tired. And, uh, if they want me to go to rehab, I will fucking go to rehab. Um, I will try. Um, if that's the only way I can stay clean and sober. The alcohol is not as much of a problem. The smoking pot is. But every time I do, headache on this side, which every CT scan comes back clean. Sorry about the quality. I know not many people watch this boring shit. I would much rather make videos, but I have a lot of anxiety and focus issues, so I've not been able to make better videos with editing and music. I have this to help me walk. It is a beautiful place to live. I like being alive. I'd like to be a productive, functioning member of society so I can contribute back. I don't deny that the things that I have done to myself over the years with drugs have caused some damage, or even the majority of the damage. But I've also had several head injuries, and I believe I need some assistance. And the doctor keeps saying, oh, it's all alcohol-related. You need to see a mental health professional. Oh, but since you're on Medicaid, you have to wait two months. And Trump wants to take it all away. He wants all the weak people to die. What kind of society, what kind of culture, what does it say of humanity that we relegate the homeless and the destitute and the people with mental issues and drug issues to the, you know, the wastes of time and history? If we have such a warrior culture, if, if we're always fighting for resources and not looking out for the little guy. What kind of culture is that? It's not one I want to be a part of. Well, is it? I don't know. Maybe. People keep telling me to be good, but everyone on YouTube seems to get views and points and clickbait rewards for being bad. And, and I don't understand it. It's the easiest way to make money, is to make fun of Eugene Cooley and her skinniness. Yet, I feel that is wrong. Yet, she seems to be promoting her anorexia. Perhaps there is a middle ground. I'm trying to find it all my life.